Hello, this is Red Wizard 52 and this is a relaxing let's play of Warhammer Mark I'm sorry, uh, Warhammer Mark of Chaos. Episode 9. And we have just been given access to uh, Stefan von Kessel, the Empire Army. And I'm concerned that um, I'm, my campaign is losing steam. And this army cannot move. This is referring to Aurelian, the High Elf uh, Sorceress. So we're going to go over here to Von Kessel. And we have a choice. We can go to this optional Warriors of the Night, which I kind of want to do that. Because I feel like that would be easier. Or we can go to Heavy Crossing. I think I'm going to do Warriors of the Night. But let's look at the um, temple real quick. Everyone is healed up. Let's go to the barracks. Oh, what's this? Jade Wizard. That's pretty cool. We don't have enough gold. Of course not. We do have a Hellblaster Volley Gun. That's awesome. Let's read about this. The Hellblaster Volley Gun has nine separate barrels divided into three decks of three barrels fixed on a circular crank. The advantage of the Hellblaster is that it can fire several shots at once in a devastating volley. A full volley will rip through the toughest regiment, causing immense casualties in the blink of an eye. The disadvantage of the Hellblaster is that it is inclined to jam or misfire. In fact, the chance of being able to fire for a prolonged time or slim as a weapon is quite likely to malfunction. The Hellblaster's barrels are organized in three groups of three. When the crew shoots, they pull the lever and discharge a group of three barrels. Then the crew will rotate the crank and place a new deck of three new barrels into firing position. Okay. Um, well, that's pretty, that, a lot of uh, detailed engineering information there. So, I guess I can't take any troops because I have no gold, so I am going to go to Warriors of the Night. Because if I get gold, then I can uh, um, get that Jade Wizard. I don't know if I should uh, concentrate on um, rank and file troops, like more swordsmen, or if I should get a, a, another hero. While his army rests at camp, Stefan von Kessel investigates the desolate ruins of Timpengast to see whether the legends of Nobu von's horde are true. Oh, it's just... This is interesting. I think we got this. The last time we did a duel, it was um, pretty simple. All magic is dangerous in sorcery more than any other, for it leaves behind much residual energy that can pollute the land, mutate wild creatures, and stir the dead in their graves. So I think there are going to be some undead in this in this game. That's awesome. I wonder what factions are represented in the game. We see Chaos, High Elves, Empire, and Skaven. That's four. So um, the undead, that would be five. That's a, that's a lot of factions for an RTS. It is as silent as a garden of more. Unnatural. Stay alert. The Garden of Moor is, um, is a base of a graveyard. Are these, these are night goblins? goblins. Oh, green skin, so that's it's actually uh, more than that. It's six. Not you, not you. The army of the Emperor you. Is under attack. Let's see. The night goblins poison you. That's, that's their thing. Fame and destruction are yours to command. They wear these little robes. Well, probably. Sorry, I didn't mean to move around so much. Just want to get in here and see the action. A little skull on the top of his helmet. Okay, so far so good. Looks like there are six left. One left. That says one. Night Goblin's one. So there's there's way more than one. I don't know if you see that. It says one, but there are clearly more than one go Night Goblin fighting. Weird. I thought I thought that number referred to how many units they have left. The might of Sigmar has crushed the foe. As the moth is drawn to the flame. Okay. Victory is assured. What's this? Silver horn. 
Immediately stops own fling units and heroes. Changes their morale up to 50%. Can only be equipped by Victory high elves and, and imperials. So what's our quest? Find three mighty artifacts. Defeat the Banshee. We shall make our step. Maybe the undead are not a faction. Maybe um, I am needed over there's there. just some monsters. Sometimes these RTSs throw in like the some non-factional line monsters. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, wait. Dead Skeleton bolt. warriors, there we they go. Destroy these undead things. Uh, will the night goblins and the, go and the undead fight? Let's see, are they fighting? It's awesome. Yeah, let them, let them fight it out first. The one thing about Warhammer is prevail. the bad factions always fight each other. It's not. So we have a problem. We have archers up here. If we go and enter melee with these skeleton warriors, I want to get a good look at them. Then um, these archers are going to just destroy uh, Stefan and um, Bright Wizard, Wizard, who I still haven't given a name. Trying to think what we should do. Hmm. I shall lead the army forth. We shall make our stand. You know, this Bright Wizard needs to drink this potion. Yeah. The flames call to me. Can I? I guess I can't. Um, just to the hero. I wish I could apply that to. Uh, Fight for the Empire! So let's get this bright wizard to take this potion. What Hopefully, do for you? that is a healing potion. I'm gonna zoom out. Bright wizards are basically pyromaniacs. The Emperor rewards the bravest. Power stone. That's not what we I was hoping for. So I guess we should go this way. I will the but we know there's going to be position. undead here. Our advance must continue. We should go for the archers first. The okay, bright wizard, get these archers. Fight for the empire. The army of the emperor is under attack. Your okay, you need to just flee. Turn that on. I must find more power. Then go and get them. Come on, Bright Wizard. He'll be good at up up close, I think. Killing those guys. Victory is assured. Okay. Maybe it wasn't a good idea to have the Bright Wizard go off by himself. Except on Vine Castle, go and save this Bright Wizard. The army of the Emperor is under attack. Okay, you're gonna have to uh, flee. Okay, get over here, Bright Wizard. Stronger. Stay back. Fight for the Empire. Let Stefan do all the fighting. He has three healing potions. What would you have me do, General? Fight for the Empire. That, they really, that, that ability really didn't do anything. Your allies in Altdorf have sent me. The fireball. Does that hurt, Stefan? I don't know if there's... I, I should probably figure out if there's friendly fire in this game or not. The might of Sigma is Alright, cool. Yeah, this we shall rout bright wizard the scum really from needs the field. some. Some. We shall rout the scum from the field. It's a trap. They were protecting the vault. Fight for your lives. Our one foe the foe has been spotted. Protect our lands. Guard our people. You cannot yeah, the run the flames of fate. The Emperor rewards the brightest. Okay. 
Oh, all right. No, 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 no. Bright wizard, you need to get over here. Archers should not be attacking you. With bitter bloodshed, we will earn victory! The army of the Emperor is under attack. I might just leave the Bright Wizard by the statue over here. The Emperor rewards the bravest. The might of Sigma we is shall rule the battlefield. For the Empire and honor! I bring destruction to the Emperor's foes. I thought he said the Emperor's foes. Fools, but I think he meant the Emperor's foes. You can reach them back there. The of Sigmar has crushed the foe. The Emperor rewards the bravest. and honor! Okay. I'm pretty good about things. from the Colleges of Magic. Okay. There is bloody work to be done this day. Lord Teclis has taught me the art of fire. As the moth is drawn to the flame. Okay, so you, Bright Wizard, go and get this of potion. Magic. The might of Sigmar has crushed the foe. And the scroll. Protect our Stefan, lands, guard our you go and get this item. Let's see. This Bright Wizard really needs Lord a healing Texas potion. Me Let's see, hopefully you can get one. The foe have been spotted. I will do what I can to bring victory. The army of he the needs this. Drink attack. that. What can the fire college do for you? Okay, so when let's go here, Bright Wizard. Here. Stefan is. I don't feel too threatened. Uh, we're learning Stefan because he has three healing stuff. potions. No, 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 no. I keep slacking going back. And he has a bright wizard back here shooting fireballs at things. Nice. The Emperor rewards the bravest. Armor of contempt. We have learned much from the elves. Yeah, this un these these undead hordes don't stand a chance against Stefan from Castle the Chaos Mark. And the fireball. There will be no rest while one foe draws breath. Protect our the lands. Of the Just this. Our um, 37.5% chance to hit lasts for 15 seconds. I wonder why I can't use it. Is it... Is it a magic spell? Maybe I'll do that. I have no idea. What's this? Experience? Not enough power, okay. Power, okay, there we go. Fight for the Empire! And then have another fireball. The might of Sigma has crushed the foe. Okay, seems safe now. The lore of fire is mine to command. The Emperor commands. Dawn armor, that's not cool. Continue. The lore of fire is mine to command. I must find more power. We found one mighty artifact of three. Man, this is going to be a long quest. I bring destruction to the Emperor's foes. So, are there mighty artifacts over here? Let's see. A fire chooses its own path. I don't want the Bright Wizard to be first. I come from the Colleges of Magic. I am needed over there. And he's level 22, that's awesome. Okay. The Bright College offers its aid. What's this? Heed not A the Banshee? Wail. Damn. Said to bring doom and death. Oh, death. The army of the Emperor is under attack. I bring destruction to the well, that's Emperor's not cool. foes. I must find more power. Let's do. Let's just get rid of these skeletons first. The gods have granted this day to earn our glory. Ow. Okay. Gotta watch his health. Plus five. He has twenty-eight of forty. So why not use that? Victory is assured. Let's just kill these skeletons first. Work to 
Okay. I guess we should. I don't know why these skeletons are taking so long. The Bright Wizards are gonna have to come in here. Okay, enough for the skeleton. Okay. So I don't know if the Bright Wizard should come in. I think that would be dangerous. No, the, the Bright Wizard needs to get out of here. Infusion. Okay, we'll, we'll use that healing potion. We have learned much from the elves. Okay. This creature needs to go down. Protect our lands, guard our people. Ten hit points left. I like how they call them hit points. They should be called wounds. If this is Warhammer, they should be wounds. Alright. So we have another. Is this a mighty artifact? What's this? Fire. Crystal of Starlight. We defeated the Banshee. Oh, okay, no, that's why it's blue. Alright. I am needed over there. So I shall lead the army forth. Guess I go I'm gonna hold off on using this we potion. I only use it if I have to. Because you heal automatically if you um, win the scenario. I am needed over there. Drinking some black coffee. That's why. I shall be when the fighting is thickest. Our advance must continue. I will survey the battle from a new position. Just don't want this guy to die. Sprite Wizard has been with me the entire time. This statue is pretty cool. I guess that would be more. M O R R. God of, uh, God of Death. Um, actually, really hates necromancers. Sees them as the. I shall be where the fighting you know, is thickest. I shall be at the forefront of the fight. Affronts to the natural order. There. This might be. Oh, this is gold. Definitely need gold. I shall lead the army forth. I shall be where the fighting is thickest. Okay. Okay. Let's see. The Empire will prevail. Let's go here. The foe have been spotted. History shall tell of the great I shall lead the, the army forth. Now one more. Oh man, okay, Bright Wizard, get away. Are those archers? No, that's not cool. Oh, thank God. All right. I wish I could have got that thing back there. I don't know what that was. I think it was gold. Did I just pick up gold? Or was that an item? Anyway. So yeah, 68,000. I feel like I'm... It, this this game is um, confusing from a score point of view because every uh, mission I have this huge score and my enemies have this low score. But I don't feel like I'm winning the game. I feel like... In terms of score, it's like, oh, you're doing great. Uh, in terms of the game, I feel like, um, you know, I'm always on the uh, precipice of losing steam. Like, I, I really don't think, I was going to do 10 episodes. I think I, I could probably do one more episode, but um, I don't think I have the steam to go on. I think I'm probably going to lose episode 10 because I've lost so many troops. Like, I think at this point, you should probably be able to have, oh, okay, so 5,000 gold, never mind. That's going to be useful. Um, let's see. So how much gold do we? We got some gold in the... Uh, the event. So 7,000. We got some gold from the, um, from the mission. So we might be able to... We might be able to salvage the situation. Okay, so I want to get this Jade Wizard. Um, level 13. 
level one jade wizard. Yeah, I definitely want to get this. this a jade wizard is a. Uh, here I'll read about them. They are um, basically nature wizards. Wizards of the Jade Order study the lore of life that lies under the province of the third lore of magic, which is called the Wind of Gyron. In Age of Sigmar, that's called the uh, Realm of Gyron. Jade wizards are, of all wizards, the most attuned to nature and least likely to be found within the confines of, the, of cities. They love nature and living things, but their studies teach them about the harmony of nature and the balance between all living things. Um, because they are so closely tied to the power of nature, their own powers tend to wax and wane with the seasons, being vigorous in the spring, most powerful in the summer, waning over the fall, and become weakest in the winter. That's pretty cool. Jade wizards have power over nature and can cast spells which cause thorns and briars to spring out of the earth, woods to appear, or mighty winds to suddenly bowl over their enemies. At his command, a jade wizard can bring uh, rain out of the cloudless sky or cause the very rocks of the earth to fly into the air. That's awesome. Yeah, kind of like um, in Lord of the Rings, this would be Radagast the Brown. Um, yeah. I think uh, the... Schools of magic are really cool. It's all elven magic. They have, this is humans who have been taught by elves how to do magic. So they're, they're not as good at it. But if we get this jade wizard, then we can give um, this um, staff of transference to them. So that'll be cool. Um, I don't know. I, I, I don't have the uh, um, attention span to um, uh, you know figure out what I should spend this money on. So I'm going to hold off until the final episode. I'm going to load up on a big army. And then we'll have this last uh, last battle here at Heavy Crossing. I'll probably save the, the game. And if people are interested, um, you know, if anybody ever comments on my videos and says, like, do another one, then I will. But um, I, I'm probably ready to move on to another game at this point. So, all right. Well, uh, thank you very much and have a good day.